Hello, hello, hello. We are live with today's stream. So let me just share that on all the social medias and then we'll hop into the game. It is... Um, Tuesday. It's Tuesday, so just Animal Crossing today. Should be a nice relaxing stream. And uh, let's just hop right in. Yes. One second. Should I, I really start doing this right before I start stream. Deactivating and reactivating just so I don't have any delay right at the beginning, but yeah. Uh, Trantor, October 19th, 320. Yep. I want to start with Slicer, just briefly before switching over. Oh, did I change my previous command? I think I did. Yes. Excellent. Okay, do we have anyone new today? We shouldn't. Regardless of anything else, yeah. No one knew, which makes sense because and thank you for that host Astro. Much appreciated as always. Definitely somebody else should go check out if you haven't already. And yeah, okay. This is from Tom Nook. And this is from home. Both of those. Uh, confirm that there is a letter in the post office. And then that's all we need to do with the slicer at the moment. What time did we start yesterday? I'm trying to think. I don't remember though. Follow dude, thank you for the sub. Very much appreciated. Uh, how's it going? Welcome on in. Uh, and that's for four months. Very impressive. And uh, yeah, as a sub, you once again get to make a sub request. So feel free to uh, do that if you so desire. It's going, good stuff, good stuff. Um, refresh it quickly. Okay. I'll deal with that later. Okay. I am doing all right. Very much on the tired side. I got pretty much no sleep last night. And then had to walk to work this morning against a very strong wind, and then also had to walk home. Well, that at least was with wind, walking home from work. But yeah. Yeah, it was a very strong wind that I was walking against this morning. Not fun. But, you know, it's what it is. Do we have 
here. Stunning toilet at Nooks. Uh, HRA. Yeah. Torso of a T-Rex. Ooh, ooh, fancy, fancy. Uh, Triceratops torso. Ooh, two torsos. Will we get a third torso? No, Triceratops skull. So two Triceratops parts, two torsos. Everything starts with the letter T. That's something interesting. Okay, and do we still have no one new? We do not. Excellent. That's the way. That's what makes sense. Um, and is my gyroid empty? It is. Excellent. Excellent. Hey, weed. Okay. Um, let's grab one, two, three, and four. I just have one more thing that we need to put in there yet. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Uh, store an item. And then, yeah, this is all stuff we can pick up later. With, a uh, Slicer, but that'll be later. For now, let us go out and about and explore town. So as of yesterday, we still had. This we only found four fossils. So there's still one fossil missing somewhere in town. Oh, we not there. Okay, we do not know where. We know at least a few spots. It's not, but there's so many spots it could be. Okay, so if anybody notices anything buried that I missed, feel free to point it out as, you know, my uh, observational skills are not the greatest. Oh, go for the yawning. Oh. I definitely need to make sure to actually go to bed at a reasonable hour tonight. Because I was up... What time did I go to bed at last night? It was like 11.30, I think. And then I started work at 5, which meant leaving at 4. Which meant waking up at like 3-ish. So, I got less than 3 hours of sleep last night. Think, thinking about it. <laughs> Doing the math. Because, like, yeah, going to bed at 11.30 means it's going to be pa was past 12 by the time I actually fell asleep. Generally takes me at least an hour to fall asleep when I go to bed. Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. what's new? Oh, right, I forgot about that. Uh -huh. I completely forgot about that. That's right. Yesterday I had accidentally asked her uh, for a job instead of just, you know, asking what's up. And then she asked me to write her a letter. So I guess we'll go check that in a little bit. Not that it really matters, but... There will be a present. Okay. Is Lilia 
again. Oh. Knocking right now. So Lily is out and about. Exploring town. Doing her thing. Could be anywhere. And everywhere. And nowhere. All at the same time. Probably. Probably somewhere. Okay. So what's everyone up to been up to today? Anyone do anything interesting? Anything fun and or exciting? There's Otis. How's it going, Otis? What's the good word? Often around this time, yeah. Let's talk. Sure. That's not true. Huh. Oh, thanks. I suppose. Doesn't really matter. We got the... Yesterday we got the, uh... The whatchamahoosit. Uh... Da, 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 words. Patchwork top, which is the last piece of fall clothing that we needed. Which means, as of now, Tell Winter Clothing is available, and we have... At which point we'll have two more standard outfits to get then, but otherwise we have... Just those two standard ones are the last standard clothing. Otherwise we have two things from holidays. Did I forget to read the message board? I think I did. Yep. I found it. And here's a letter from, uh, Opal. Thanks. Uh, am I a lazy writer? I am I a lazy writer. All writers are lazy. Pop Bloom shirt. Interesting. Slowly learning new world PC game other than just studying all day. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. How are you enjoying New World? I know a few people are playing it. Uh, a few people I know are playing it. <laughs> Obviously a lot more than just a few people are playing it. But... Yeah. Uh, entertain me. I know that. Yep. I've got t 25 songs from him. There's our first fossil, though. Uh, if you rush, it gets really repetitive really soon. Oh, yeah. I mean... As is abundantly clear, repetitive gameplay is not a turn-off for me. <laughs> okay, but... Lead us our curiosity. Current prices. 105. Okay. Okay. Sixteen six thirty five. And just out of curiosity, like it doesn't actually even matter now. Nothing they're selling upstairs is gonna be something they'll actually need. I do like just doing a quick run around upstairs to see what they are selling. Okay, okay. Toilet, chair, bench, a lot of sitting implements. I mean, you could even sit on the rock. I suppose you could sit on a uh, cabinet cupboard here, or cabinet or whatever it is. That'd be a bit of a tall thing. I would not recommend sitting on uh, the golf bag. I don't know if the golf club's in it. But hey, each their own. Uh, 
Okay. Bad example, but depends on the game. Do you have some plate station two games with ten plus? Uh completions. Because you enjoy it, yeah. Yeah. I grind against you, yeah. I mean, that's all. also the thing, like, repetitive stuff, it can depend on, like, yeah, the type of thing or whatever, because there's definitely, like, you know, you know, I'm playing Animal Crossing, I'm going through the same general, uh, routine each day or whatever, and that I have a little problem with most of the time. But there are definitely some things where it's just, like, you know, the repetitive nature can get to me. It all depends on... I guess it depends on how how much I'm enjoying it. Because, like, if I'm enjoying it... For, there's a lot of things where, like, if I'm enjoying it one time, I'll generally be... In, I can enjoy it, like, a hundred times or whatever. But if I'm not enjoying it the first time, even, well, then... I'm probably not going to enjoy it the hundredth time. Also something that you... And I mean, some, there's definitely some stuff where you will enjoy it first, and then it'll start getting annoying. Maybe there's stuff that you'll start off disliking and eventually like... I mean, I definitely have some music that's like that, where, like, songs where the first time I heard it, I'm like, I don't like this song, but hear it enough and you just kind of get used to it. <laughs> but, yeah. So, I mean, you know. All t types. What was I saying? I don't know. So if it's starting to get to you, you're going to be uh, taking a break from it or continuing with it anyway. digging random holes. Oh, it's terrible for me, Freya. Absolutely terrible. But I mean, I enjoy some of it. What's going on? Do when you have something to, someone to play with. Ah, okay, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Buy from Nook. Not like there are many other options. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, it definitely sounds like it could be more fun. <laughs> Play with other people and such. I definitely get that. Uh, it's gonna be nothing to report today, right? Any goings on? Nothing of important to report. Just like I suspected. Secondly, and nextly, anything lost, and Bimo, thank you for that follow, very much appreciated. All right, nine. Uh, how's it going? How are you doing? Welcome on in. All right, we have these turnips. Um, I'll grab. I'll start. I'll grab three of them for now. These are spoiled turnips. I just need to get rid of them. So grab three of them for now, so that I don't forget. Or if I do forget, like at least I'm doing, I obviously don't have a don't have a room in my inventory for all of them. So yeah, you like this? Very cool. Good stuff. Glad to hear it. Okay. I swear, I, I know how to aim my shovel. 
Although re recent days have started putting that in uh, that that in doubt. All the shovel, all the digging I've been missing as of late. Still only got the one fossil. Should I be worried? I've yet to get the money rock, although that's less worrying. We're not going to be missing the money rock, and it, if we did, like, I know all the rocks in town. So it wouldn't take me too long to go through and check again. Oh, well, there's one of our fossils over there. I already see that one. We'll come across. Wait, what's up there? Oh, insect, grasshopper, locust or something. Good stuff. Weed. Let's pluck all the weeds. No weeds must remain in town. So saith I, and I saith so. Good. Oh, hey, freckles. Okay. Oh, well, which word am I supposed to say? Fall is sardine season. If you won't catch any sardines in the river. Then, then why are you, why are you telling me this? And there was Lily running by. Recently to talk to. So now we have. I did not oversleep. I've been awake since 3 a.m. Lily isn't healthy either, but in the other direction. Um, sure. Of course. <laughs> uh, I did help somebody in need today. At work. There was a customer who was asking me where the french fries were. Everything's perfect. Trying was a very little place. Yes, ask you where... Yeah, the customer asked me where the french fries were, and I'm like, oh yeah, over in aisle, whatever number, or whatever. And he's like, oh, are they not over here? And he points over to, like, the produce cooler, and I'm like, N nope. And he asked me if I knew what french fries were, and I'm like, yeah, I know what french fries are. <laughs> like, <laughs> I, I, I was so confused by that interaction. You know, it is what it is. <laughs> I was talking to a co-worker about that later, and she's like, maybe we should have asked him if he knew what french fries were, <laughs> asking if they were in the produce cooler. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, now I want french fries. Oh, I myself up at A&W on my way home from work tomorrow. I was tempted to do that today, but I decided not to, because I'm like, uh, too high a chance I'll end up being late for stream, which I mean, I uh, still a bit late for stream, but, you know. But tomorrow I get off work at, like, even earlier, so... May mayhaps. Now you do too? Kind of. Yeah. I mean, french fries are just so good. Put we'll the log onto your new leaf account. Nice. One second. Text uh, from my mom I just need to quickly respond to.
Billy. Billy the Kid. Have you tried decaf? Can you hear crickets outside of your belly? Do you eat crickets? It's longer from seeing the harvest. So what which is every everyone's favorite Animal Crossing game? I mean, mine is this one by default. Well, I mean, the, the only ones I played are this one in Pocket Camp, and this is definitely Beats of Pocket Camp. But, yeah, eventually I plan to play them all one day in the future. Possibly far in the future. Did we talk to Gonzo? We did talk to Gonzo, I think, yeah. We also talked to Freckles already. Okay, so we just need to talk to... Caesar and J. We still only found two fossils, though, which is worrying. Because there's still three fossils in town. Best Animal Crossing is the original or City Folk. Okay. So, original is obviously, you know, what I'm playing here, what I have a ton of experience with. Uh, so, um, but why, what, what, what would you say is, like, why City Folk is one of uh, the best? I mean, you can also say I guess for this one as well, because just because I'm familiar with this doesn't necessarily mean your reasons for... I, I know your reasons for thinking this one's the best. Because obviously, different people enjoy different things with the same game. Uh, okay, so what do we have here? Maple leaf and cloudy paper. Let's keep the skyline paper. OG is the most charm and the best background music by far, Aya. Ah, yeah. Wild World, just because it was your first. I mean, yeah, nostalgia is always a, like, nostalgia is not something you can really argue against. Like, it's like, oh yeah, you know, the first game you play that in a series will often have a special place in your heart and such. And it's always a good uh, thing. City Folk is the best balance for Conrad. Okay, okay. This one is right after. Ah, oh, yeah. October 20th. Oh, yeah, Nook is having a sale tomorrow. Sorry, Jay, I, I won't be there. Um, Because, A, the sale isn't going to include anything I need, and, B, it's at a time I won't be playing anyway, so, you know. It is what it is. Caesar, my dude. Do you have a salad for me? Uh, let's talk. That, that wasn't me, I swear. Like new leaf, because you can stack fruit, mass sell, donate, assess fossils and items. Just to, yes, that's definitely something that, like, um, some of the improved, like, st stuff like that is definitely something I'm going to be looking forward to when I eventually get up to, like, New Leaf and other stuff that has it. All the world, you got the nostalgia goggles for, play on your windowsill at night every day. Oh, nice. Magical. So convenient. Just wish they ported it to Wii U slash Switch. Yeah. Uh... Unlikely, though, because obviously Wii U, they're not doing stuff for anymore, and Switch has its own Animal Crossing and New Horizons. So, yeah. 
Not super likely. Okay, so we only found three fossils. I am not a fan of the fact that we only found three. What do we have in the post office for letters at the moment? Just the one. Uh, let's just save this letter from Opal. This page, I think. I was about to go to the next page, but I'm like, oh wait, or the previous page. I'm like, no, this might still be one. How things are different, yeah. New Horizons was as good as it was bad. Don't know if the update will fix that feeling. Ah, yeah. Um, do I want to search around a bit more for that? For at least one more fossil. It's definitely tricky because, like, you know, obviously, as soon as, like, Animal Crossing with each game, you want to do new stuff, but also if you change too much, you know, fans are going to be, you know, not like the, you know, all the changes and such. And it's a very delicate balancing act. Don't like the fact you can choose your animals in New Horizons. Okay, okay. Nope, no fossil there. Did anyone see a anything buried somewhere that I missed? Because if so, feel free to let me know. But yeah. all the owls are basically the same in New Horizons anyway. Just have a look at the dialogue here. Oh, geez, just so well written. I mean, the dialogue in this one is still like, you know. Um, consistent across, like, personality types and whatever. Because I've definitely had it, you know, where I'll have the same villager, the same uh, personality type tell me the same bit of dialogue and such. Definitely had that happen quite a few times. But, yeah. Just found a rotten turnip by your house. Was it one of these? Literally a swarm of ants around it. Yep. Had some of those yesterday in my town. Ants and cockroaches. and donate to the museum. I've already completed my fish and insect collections. Good stuff, good stuff. And my museum is completely complete because I also got all the fossils and all of the paintings. fossils by just randomly running around like this. It's not necessarily the best thing. Having all the, you know, in a while, see your towns all run with weeds. Uh, yeah. Yeah, definitely dealing with weeds can be a bit annoying. Yeah, 
yeah, I, I definitely try to play daily, and I always do my run around town, so I'll just, you know, pull weeds as I see them, but if it's just weeds everywhere, it's like, well, that just takes forever. I, I, I want to 100% all of the NES games within Animal Crossing, because I already have um, most of them. Everything's for the Forbidden Four up here. Uh, we already have the spots for the Forbidden Four, so this is where Ice Climber will go, Legend of Zelda, Mario Brothers, and Super Mario Brothers. But yeah, I want to part of 100% Animal Crossing, 100% all of the NES games within Animal Crossing as well. Everything from, you know, Balloon Fight, Baseball, Clue Clue Land, Clue Clue Land D, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong Jr., Donkey Kong Jr. Math, Donkey Kong 3, Excite Bike, Golf, Ice Climber, Legend Zelda, Mario Brothers, uh, Pinball, Punch Out, Soccer, Super Mario Brothers, Tennis, and Warriors Woods. I am a ridiculous person. I do. I I I understand that. And thank you for the follow. Very much appreciated. Is your name said uh, Safiro? Is that how I say your name? But yeah. Thank you for very much for the follow. This is what I got for completing the museum. Museum model. Yes. Awesome. Okay, I don't... I think we're gonna find one of the other fossils, so we're just gonna send away what we have right now. <laughs> you love that? Yeah. What, what, what do you say I love that to? Me talking about the NES games, or like me showing off the museum model? Uh, what am I doing mailing letters? Thank you. Yeah. It's, yeah. Yeah, my main floor has uh, the Mario series. Um, let's go back to my house. So, main floor has uh, the Mario series, uh, the Nintendo set, the Lucky Nintendo set, which is these two trophies, uh, the Nintendo bench, which I don't think is part of any set or series, it's just its own thing. A bunch of candy, but that's just because of uh, Halloween coming up, I'm getting ready for that. And these gyrizers rant here for now, that's, they're gonna be going to one of my other characters' houses eventually. Up here I have, yeah, my Nintendo collect, my NES collection, and in the basement, uh, random storage, mostly models, and, uh, outfits, largely outfits from Gracie, plus a few others like the work shirt uniform here. Is that actually the only one that's not from Gracie? I think so. And then my other characters' houses, um... In this town, because I also have another town which we'll be visiting a little bit. This is Samantha's house. Main floor is right now virtually empty. It's going to be the spooky series once we get that on Halloween. Upstairs is the space series. I uh, still need the um, lunar surface for the carpet, but otherwise it's uh, complete. And basement is a nearly complete collection of wallpapers. Mm. 
And then over here we have Jake's house, which main floor is going to be the the Harvest series once we get that out of the Harvest Festival next month. Upstairs is the um, Camper series, Camper Furniture, plus, uh, what is it, the Daisy Meadow flooring, and we're going to get uh, whatever the equivalent uh, wallpaper is eventually. Currently it's just whatever this starting wallpaper was, I think, or something we just put up at random at some point, I don't know. And then a nearly complete collection of carpets here in the basement. Then over here we have Slicer's house. Main floor is the Snowman series. Upstairs is going to be all of the igloo furniture. Once we get that, this which we'll work on this this winter. And then basement is like the random like gifts and such you get from mostly Tortimer, but a few other things. These are all my characters. All, like this is just me. Like I, I have multiple characters um, that I'm using so I can have like stuff set up like this. Uh, yeah. The, the names I was giving were just the names of, like, the actual, like, characters. They're all my characters. <laughs> no worries, no worries. Uh, I'd like to sell... Pull 40 bells. And while we're here, let's buy the candy so we don't forget later. Yeah. yeah, I actually have, so I have four characters in this town, and then I have another three characters in my town of Pretorius, and then I have another three or four characters in my town of Meltwork 4, although I can't currently access that town. And eventually I want even more towns. Um, so. Actually, well, we're going to drop this off, but, um. Let's just quickly drop this off here. We're going to have to for some of candy stairs. So, in Animal Crossing, at least in this one, I don't know if it's the case in other Animal Crossing games, a random day in July is your town day. In my case, it's uh, July 27th is Trantor Day. On the, on Trantor Day, what I got from Tortimer was um, this uh, train station model, which is train station model... Station Model 7, which is, you know, an accurate representation of the train station we have here in town. As you can see. There are 15 different train stations, each has its own model. So eventually I'm going to have a total of 15 villages, just so I can have one for each different train station, so I can get all the train station models. <laughs> but I first need more memory cards before I do that. So, yeah. Oh. Now we're going to head over to my other town. <laughs> what were they thinking? They were thinking... Nobody was actually going to be absurd enough to try 100%ing this game. I mean, you can, I guess, get them also via, like, universal codes or whatever. But as part of my 100%ing, I'm not using 
codes, other than the stuff that needs codes. Like, uh, so the Mario series, like, most of the stuff you saw on my main floor, which is the Mario series, that you have to use universal codes to get. And there's a few of the NES games that you need to use code generator codes to get. So those I, I got via code. But, like, everything... But anything that I can get just in-game without using codes, I have done so. Um, Project Hyrule, what? I'm, I'm, I'm not sure what you're, you mean by that, what you're referencing there. Rover, if that is your real name. Rover, you see me like every day. If you didn't remember me, that would be more weird. General Oh, General Lotus goes back then. Okay. Yeah. yeah see, I, I, I use a code generator where you type in your, um, you know, yeah. Because code generator codes, like, you need to put in your character name and your town name and then it creates, you know, codes that are specific to y you, as opposed to universal codes, which just work for anyone. But some things don't, you know, have universal codes you need to use. Stuff that's specific. Okay, so this is my secondary town here, Pretorus. Um... There's a lot more people, has a lot more villagers in it because, like, you know, most of the time when I travel here, somebody moves here. It also has a lot of weeds and not a lot of trees because I don't take care of this town. And I, a while back when I was working on, like, getting gyroids, just chopped down, like, all, almost all the trees in this town other than the fruit trees just so I can more easily find gyroids and such. Oh, this is new. Uh, black. Queen in one of the one acres. So along the left side, okay. Uh, what do we, we got in the dump? Sunset paper and a picnic table. Is there a picnic basket for Yogi Bear to steal? Hello, Tom Nook. Uh, first of all, just out of curiosity, turnip prices, 81, okay. So even if we had turnips, I mean, yeah, even if we had bought turnips this, this past Sunday, we wouldn't be selling them today in either of my towns, no price spike. Just out of curiosity as well, what do we got for sale up here? What's this one? I don't know why I have it. Oh, that's the fall plaid shirt. Yeah, I definitely have that one. I mean, I know anything Nook is selling right now is something I already have. Because, like, the only standard clothing I'm missing are not available at this time of year. <laughs> The desert shirt and the and cafe's shirt, both of which are winter outfits. You're on a cleanup mission right now to clean up all the trash you have on your world. Oh yeah. That'd be like if I was trying to clean up this town. That would be that would be a mission and a half. Uh, any goings on? Actually, yeah, we'll get. Yes. That's awesome, Gracie. Because we need more outfits from Gracie. We still have seven outfits from Gracie we need, so... Um, so Gracie on the 24th. What is today? Today is the 19th, and it's... Uh, Tuesday, so Sunday, I think. Let me just check the calendar to confirm that. Yeah, that's Sunday. Okay, so Sunday, Gracie. Sounds good. Okay. And 
other question we have for you? Anything lost? Nothing lost, okay. Let's go check if Gulliver's randomly washed ashore today. Like it. And just a little bit over here. I have seen him wash up on this little bit here before, like once. <laughs> Normally, it's not, it doesn't happen very often, but it has happened. Alfonso, the one person I actually talk to in this town because he's my favorite villager. Uh, just hang in. Catfish yeah, just anywhere. Oh, yeah. Those black shadows wriggling in the water. Uh, good stuff, Alfonso. Good stuff. Hey, Link's walking in. How's it going? How are you doing? All right, we we're gonna be searching for the, the thing that was buried in town. So we'll start at the bottom and work our way up. Imagine it was this thing right here. Oh, that's just a gyroid. A wee dingloid. Doing alright. Just got home. Good stuff. Good stuff. I am doing well. Definitely on the tired side, but I mean, what else is new? When am I not? And thank you for that host, Bemo. Much appreciated. Are you yourself a streamer? Uh, Mega Crocoid. Chaotic, oh yeah. And Lynx, thank you as well for the for the host. I I literally just said the word host like, you know less than a minute ago and already my brain is blanking on it. Not to mention that the alert itself is, you know, Lynx has hosted you or whatever exactly the wording is. <laughs> Also, yeah, definitely all of y'all should go check out Links. A wonderful mod here, and a wonderful streamer as well. Um, if you enjoy my stream, you'll love her stream. Play, last playing some Mario Kart 8. How did the Mario Kart 8 go? How was that? So was... Yes, I was watching a bit of that yesterday, yes. <laughs> I didn't think for a second. Ah, here we go. Here's the black queen. But. Yeah. Oh yeah, I should also show off my houses in this town. Because I'm already showing off my my main houses in my, 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 houses in my main town. Here's houses in my secondary town here. So here is James's house. Which, I've, I haven't done anything with the wallpaper or carpet, but like, my cockroach is stuck there. I can't get at it. That's interesting. Uh, uh, well, yeah, we have nearly all of the Gulliver uh, items in here. And then upstairs, I think is empty for now, yeah. I'll eventually figure out something to put up here, but I haven't yet. Wow, this cockroach. There we go. Like any Mario Monday, played Origami King the Mario Kart and was interesting yesterday. Yeah, basement is empty here at the moment. Then we have Jonathan's house, which is a special treat. Hope you all like gyroids. Um, 
And these are, every one of these gyroids here on the main floor is, you know, there's no doubles down here. Up here I have some doubles. In fact, these are all like doubles of ones are down there. A few of them are even, I have two even up here of those tall ones there in the back, but yeah. Basement is, I think, empty right now, but it'll also be more gyroids down here. How long have I been playing? Well, so my main town, Trantor, the one we were in earlier, I started January 1st of this year. This town here is technically older because, so my current town, character here of Rick and Trantor, and the town of Trantor, is my second attempt at 100 sending it. The first attempt ended when I lost, lost the save data to memory card corruption. But so this town here I'd already created to use as a secondary town back then. So this town is a bit older. I can't remember exactly how old. But some stuff like the gyroid collection in here, I didn't... The gyroid collection in here was only built with it in, you know, since earlier this year. Um, I didn't, like, that wasn't something that I had in here previously. Um, and such. And this house here is, um, Carla's, which I think is just completely empty. Oh, other than, like, the starting stuff. I don't think that she has anything other than, like, yeah. Other than the actual starting stuff. Completely empty. And the cockroaches, I guess. I guess the cockroaches aren't technically starting stuff. Fully upgraded house! And just, like, nothing in it. But, yeah. And then I've yet to make a fourth character in this town. Haven't got around to it yet. So, yeah. Eventually I'll do that. One day. One day. Or another. I'd like to sell this Black Queen. Uh, let's buy all the candy here. I'm gonna have way more candy than I need, I'm sure. I don't know how much candy I'm even gonna need at Halloween, but we're gonna have plenty. Hey, not pro yet. Welcome in. How's it going? How are you doing? Links, if you missed not pro yet, you need a better aim. <laughs> Okay. Ooh, look at my funds. If I just had four more, it would be all sixes. Just four more bells. Playing Halo, nice, nice. Which Halo? Okay, I think otherwise we're done in town here, so we'll head back to my main town. Make a spa room. Ooh, nice. Ooh, Halo 1. Good stuff. Playing, like, campaign or multiplayer or what? Because yeah, Halo 1 and Halo 2 are the only ones I've actually played the actual campaign of. For multiplayer also played Halo 3 and I think ODST? A very little bit of that, though. Most of what I've played for multiplayer is Halo 2. And a little bit of 3. And a little bit of 1, I think, way back in the day. Okay. I like a bamboo bed. Looks like a Japanese. Spar nice, nice. And a cute little flower fan. Nice. Oh, 
I was like seeing what kind of stuff people come up with. Like, setting up stuff in Animal Crossing it can be quite creative. Especially like in the later ones that just add in so much more stuff and give you more control over th various things. Let's be honest, Rover, I am still pitiful looking. There's no shame in that. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's see now. What is the dealio? Uh, campaign Halo, the original did not even have all. Yeah, that's correct. It, yeah, it was just local multiplayer. Yeah. Uh... Okay, so we now have a new villager. Olive. Oh, and Lily moved away. So Lily moved to Pretorius. Because when you travel to another town, often one of your characters will move to that town. Uh, all of moving in isn't directly related to the traveling. That's just because you have, like, a new villager will... Assuming you have room, you'll have a new villager, like, move in, like, every 24 hours or so. And so when we started playing today, it hadn't been 24 hours yet from when we had a new villager move in yesterday. But now because we traveled... Like, it reloads the town, and now it has been 24 hours, so that's why all have now moved in. So, um... First, let's drop off this candy. Had multiplayer just not yet online. Yeah, Halo 2 was the first of the... Although I think the... I almost think the PC version of Halo 1 added in... Had multiplayer. It was just the Xbox version that didn't or something? I can't remember. Maybe they recall something about that. Main room is from the Harvest set. Have almost everything from when he got it on a birthday. Oh, nice. Clock of Halo 2 has a two-month free trial that has yet to be used, but I can't use it because it's expired. Oh, yeah. Um... Yeah, we're going to go talk to our new villager. Just introduce ourselves. Oh, there's Olive. Oh, I know Olive. Like, obviously this is the first time Rick's meeting Olive, but like, I've seen Olive in, like, past towns and such, with other characters. Okay. And then, um... And I think we're going to... Okay, first we're going to go and... Uh, I know it, nothing's increased with my percentages, but we're going to double check it. Just because, yeah. This all original paperwork came with it, even a little paper telling you to go buy the soundtrack. Nice. What's this about pizzas? It's not pro yet buying pizzas for all of us. That's what I'm assuming is happening. Based on Lynx's question. Um, see my catalog. So we should still be at 526 for furniture. Indeed. 64 wallpaper. 64 carpet. 236 clothing. Uh, 56 items. 61 on station. What? Uh, 
how did we, what? <laughs> why 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 are we at 62 stationary N numbers going up is generally a good thing but how What? How did we get the festive paper today all of a sudden? I'm... What? Um... Now I need to figure this out. Because I was pretty sure that's the one that we get, like, let's see here... Um... Don't ask questions. No, but I need to know. Um... Um... Cause that's something you're supposed to get like a Christmas time or something. Uh, stationary. Okay, so... You can get it in a letter from your mom, or a letter from Jingle. We did get, did we get a letter from our mom today? We must have. Um, can I need to go look, look at my, um, Look at my VOD from the, the beginning of today's stream. Um. Or near the beginning. No, because we didn't... Wait, we didn't even... No, we didn't get our letter from our mom today, even. So how? Okay, let me look at the VOD from... Yesterday. Did I... Somehow just miss this yesterday? Thank you for that host, uh, Shaney, Shawnee. Let me know how to say your name. Um, okay, let's see here. Where was I looking at my catalog yesterday? Here we go. Yeah, 
It's Eric. Okay, there we go. Items 56. Stationary 61. So... Was a follow not a host? Did I say host? I could have sworn I said thank you for the follow. I was definitely thinking thank you for the follow. <laughs> I did say host. Ah, my bad. <laughs> my brain is just broken right now. Sorry about that. So... Shani. Okay. Okay. So then my only guess here is that I somehow already had the festive paper that I got previously at some point, and it was a different paper that I was missing, which I got today. The problem is figuring that out would, you know, in order to figure that out, I have to like go through, comb through so many, um, so many VODs to make sense of that. So. We're not going to do that. I am going to scroll through and make sure. So, we shouldn't have the fortune paper or the New Year's card. So I'm just gonna search through to make sure we don't have those two. As long as we don't have those two, this otherwise makes sense. Which does bring up the question of which stationery I was missing, though. That's now gonna be bugging me. But. Whatever. It is what it is. Just plow on the beach and it's cursed to look at. Oh, why is that? Okay, well. So we've got the... what was the festive paper, right? Around 23. Let's just... Yeah, festive paper we've got. So that... Okay, okay. Definitely that was not progress I was expecting to be making today. I was expecting to get that around Christmas time. Um... But that, that's why we do check the uh, the catalog daily, even if we don't think we've got anything, because maybe sometimes we have. So let's just check what the percentage is now. Um, calculator: sixty-two divided by sixty-four equals ninety-seven percent on stationery. Okay. Gyroids should be 127. That can't have gone up because that's already full. And uh, Fossil is also full at 25. And Music is 25. Okay. If Music ever went up without me understanding it, that would be really confusing. I mean, what was the stationery I even picked up today? Skyline paper. 
sure I've had that one before. There's another one we picked up in the dump in like Pretorius today, which I don't remember what that one was, but okay, whatever. Yep. We got the massive paper at some point. Accidentally didn't cross it off the list, crossed something else off the list that we didn't have and which we somehow got today by random chance. That's that that's clearly what happened. It's the only thing that makes sense. We just have to accept that. We have to move on with our lives. Um I wanna make a deposit. Actually first before I deposit. Look at that, all sixes. Okay. <laughs> now that that's done, let's go with what we're actually going with. Uh, 30,000. Don't know how you didn't catch it either. How you didn't catch what either? The, 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 paper, the stationary thing? I mean, that could have happened at any time, like... Um, in the past ten and a half months, <laughs> like, it could have easily happened at a time you weren't even here. So, you know, could have theoretically happened Could have theoretically have them, you know, within January, in which case, you know, it was before you were even here. But it could also have been like on any given day that you weren't here. Or on a, you know, on a day at a time that you weren't, on a day that you were here but at a time that you weren't here. Like you could have been sleeping, driving, streaming yourself, like, it's all sorts of things that could have been the reasoning all the day before your birthday ah oh, yeah nice an early birthday present to yourself thank you thank you I like I very much like my house okay let's play some balloon fight yes. let's go One second, I'm gonna quickly deactivate and reactivate just because the audio feels a little off. Phase one. Yep. That feels better. If I somehow lose my other balloon and die before we even get to the first bonus round, I am gonna immediately exit and re-enter the game. I, 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 I said I was going to. <laughs> nice meeting you as well. Discover that Halo one uh, pistol. It's not a little pistol. Halo one pistol is very powerful. You've been told about its power, but not you witnessed it yourself. Uh, Soon realize that this may be the best weapon in the game. Interesting. It's 
It's been a little while since I played the first Halo, so can't don't really remember the weapons specifically specific to that one too well. Problem is Halo One and Halo Two kind of blend together in a lot of ways in my head. Um, Cause I played like for the campaign, I played them like one after the other. I played Halo One, then went straight to Halo Two. And I do remember liking the gameplay of Halo Two better, just because of the fact that it, you know. I mean, part of that might also be because of the fact that. Back in the day when I played multiplayer with friends, that was largely Halo 2, so that's the one I was familiar with. Let's leave that lightning to do its own thing. So if you're going to be doing, going to be playing Halo 1 and then going straight to Halo 2, nice. Yeah. Yeah, I did not immediately continue on to Halo 3, though, because I don't have an Xbox 360. Just an original Xbox. I have... I do have Xbox 360 on my future purchase list, though. So one of these days I'll get myself an Xbox 360. One of these days. I mean, now that I'm getting too many hours of work and actually, you know, having spending money, we'll see. There's still a lot of things ahead of it on my future purchase list, so still won't be, like, for a while, but, you know, I am at least making progress on my future purchase list now. Which is always nice to make progress. Ooh, we're exactly 100,000. I have Xbox 360, so if you find a copy of Halo 3, you'll buy it. Nice. If I went to your local game store, but just couldn't find a copy of Halo 3. Never mind the Xbox 360 section. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Me, I generally... Oh, I should, I should close my VOD that's open in other tabs still. I generally go with just, like, going on eBay or whatever. Or buying older games. I actually just bought what I buy recently. Thor God of Thunder for the Nintendo Wii, which is tie into the first Thor, tying game to the first Thor movie, and I'm sure an absolutely terrible game, <laughs> much like Iron Man 1 and 2 and Incredible Hulk also for the Wii, which I've played, all of which I played on stream. Mm. What's tomorrow?
Other than Wednesday, I mean. <laughs> Even not Proya doesn't know what's tomorrow. So, you know, how can he be ready if he doesn't even know what he's supposed to be ready for? Bonus round. Coming at ya. Okay, another perfect. We are moving and grooving, folks. Ooh, 300,000. Past 300,000. 300, Points mark. Phase 17. chat die? It's okay if everyone just decided to start lurking. Just want to make sure. <laughs> it's still working. Okay. Here, just making pacement. Yeah, no worries. Uh, more spooky builds. We're gonna get up to the top 
and we are going to go on break now. One second. Uh, my mom is coming to drop off some food for me. So I'm going to go on break, eat said food, and then be back in like 15, maybe 20 minutes. We'll see exactly how long it goes. I guess it perfectly depends on what kind of food it is, how long it takes me to eat it, all that. But yeah, so go on break. If any of y'all need to take a break, now's the perfect time to do it. Get up, stretch, get some food for yourself, drinks, use the washroom, all that jazz. And I'll be back in like 15, 20 minutes.
Hey, I am back. Sorry if I scared anyone, because I do know <laughs> with the game's pause, there's no music, so stream's been silent while I've been on break. So hopefully I didn't scare anyone by suddenly coming back, but let's uh, get back into the game. <laughs> Forgot you were on my stream. <laughs> Yeah, sorry if I scared you. Thank you, Lynx. Thank you. Hey, not pro yet. Kind of worried there about that uh, lightning coming at me, but luckily it did not hit. Okay. We got another bonus stage. Full of bonusiness. Bonusiness? That doesn't even sound like a good word. Uh, yeah, hopefully you all had a good break. I know I did. It's a nice uh, mashed potatoes and meatballs and gravy and coleslaw. Actually, back off here a minute. Okay, there we go. Ah, crap, 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 crap. What happened there? Ooh, that was very close to that lightning. That was also very close to that lightning. Eric, what are you doing with your life? Other than risking it immensely. Okay, okay. Phase 20. Let's go. Everything. Here or do I have to go down there? Okay, you're coming up here. <sighs> Just survive, he's going in the water. Just need to stay alive until the fish gets him. Or he drowns. Okay. And then 21. Just need to get through this one. And then We'll get our balloon back. Stay calm, stay cool, stay collected, stay Canadian. Awesome. Back to two balloons.
That was some. Um... Oh, missed the balloon there. Not oh, perfect, that's fine. Don't need a perfect on all, every bonus round. Even if it's cool, it's not part of my personal 100% definition for this game, but. Whew, okay. Breathe, Eric. Breathe. It's important to breathe. Phase 22. Crap, 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 crap. Down to one balloon again. What what's the phase we're on again? I mean we're about to find out. 24. Okay, so I need to beat this one, then I get back up to two balloons again. Okay, this is dual. Damn it. If it wasn't for that lightning. I didn't notice the cloud was glowing. Oh. If it wasn't for that lightning, I would have been fine. You, you gotta pay attention to the clouds, Eric. You gotta pay attention. And when the cloud starts glowing, you start going. Oh well. Lightning situation was terrifying there. And that lightning situation killed me. Good talk. Where am I? Okay. Yeah, once that lightning starts going really quickly, it's just like it's hard to keep track of where. You can safely go and not go and such.
Oh. Okay. Do we at least get into the 30s today? Perfect after messing up on the last one. Now, notice a habit of my deaths happening after I mess up on a bonus stage. I don't know if it's because of, like, you know, messing up on a bonus stage messes with my confidence or what, but. I guess even though I don't consider it, you know, from a hundred percent, I do still think of it as a mistake when I do miss a balloon in the bonus stage. And then, you know, once you make one mistake, it's a lot easier to continue making more mistakes. I'm surprised that wasn't a mistake. No, I mean, let's be honest, that was still a mistake. I shouldn't have put myself into that position. Didn't wound up not, you know, hurting me that time. But it very easily could have. Where can I see if they go here? Okay, I need to. There we go. Oh, that into the fish. I was not expecting, with how far to the left he was, to actually go to the water like that. Ah, I lost the balloon. That wasn't supposed to happen there. Oh, so that means that was 30, I think. So we did make it to the 30s at least. The big thing I need to be doing is working on my consistency at this point. But the fact that I made it up to phase 45 is good and all, but I need to be like consistently making it, well, first that far and then further. is not too bad. I realize being directly above a cloud when it's glowing, it's fine, because it's always going to go at an angle, right? Lightning, so... That's actually not a half bad... spot to be. round. Oh 
But here we're not getting perfect, I don't think. No, no, we're not. Yeah, missed one. Ah! Missed three. Seventeen. Oof. That's rough. <laughs> Especially those last two. I should not have missed... Both. Especially not both of those last two. Okay. 34. There it is. This one. Be back later? No worries. Uh, no idea if I'll be... How much longer I'll be streaming for, but we'll see. I don't know how I've been streaming for already. Two hours. Okay. But thanks for hanging out. Thanks again for the follow. That's it for a balloon fight today. Kind of the 30s, so that's something. Let's go something a bit uh, lower key and do a round of baseball. Which I'm sure we'll regret immensely. They are P, so they're white and red, so we're going to be blue and red, yeah, which is C. Okay, so we're batting to start. Nice, nice. Uh, I'm not going to push it. Might have been able to make it to second, but it would have been a risk. That a home run? That is definitely a home run. Good start to the game. I approve. Ooh, that's gonna end badly, probably. Yep. Okay, that's fine. That might have been a ball had I not swung. Hard to tell with those fast ones sometimes. Uh, nope, that's another out for me. That's another home run? Nice. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. I was very worried that was going to be a foul. <laughs> it was like right along the line. Ah, got a first safely. That's a good first step. Ah, strike. Come on, Eric, just hit the ball. That's all there is to it. There is... You can hit the ball or you cannot hit the ball. 50-50. So just go with the correct option. There we go. Nice. Even got my guys to second and third. Instead of first and second. Is that another home run? No, no. Nah. But 
I did get at least another point there. Oh, that's... Oh, please don't catch it. Please don't catch it. Ah, that was an out. Okay, well, we got four points. Not bad for a first inning. I normally do not get four points in the first inning, so I will take that. That's a foul. Come on, buddy. You can do better. Actually, don't, don't do better than that. Nice. I guess technically that was in some ways better than a foul. He, you know, hit it in the right area. Just my guys caught it. Uh, you're safely getting to first. Yeah, that's fine. For now. That's a foul. First and second. But it is what it is. Catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it. Nice. Okay, one more out is all I need, and we change. Awesome. Good. Safe on first. Ah, uh, that I should not have swung at. That was clearly a ball. <laughs> was that another home run? No. That's an out, in fact. That's unfortunate. That was no good. <laughs> oh, that's foul. Okay. Eating. Be back later. Okay, no worries. Uh, may or may not be streaming when you come back. To the, if you come back later today, but I'm not sure how long we'll be going for. Ooh, that's in. Come on, guys, get the ball. Hurry up, get the ball. Why is the guy close to stop running? Made it all the way to third, because the one guy just stopped running. That's just, no. That's not cool. That's foul. That's foul. Okay. Well, they got a point. That's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Outs on them yet? Sinning? Okay, I mean, apparently not. Got two in one play though. That is definitely nice. Okay. go. My turn again. At bat. <coughs> Damn it. So close. 
Oh, that's not gonna... Yeah, no. Slow pitch threw off my timing. Oh. Why are their fielders so good? I, I'm winning. <laughs> and just complaining about it. <laughs> that I'm not winning by more. <laughs> yeah, 4 1 for me. I got some nice uh, points there on the first inning and haven't been able to get any more since. Okay. I managed to keep them from getting most... They've gotten one point, otherwise I managed to keep them from getting... Excuse me. I'm getting anything beyond that. Okay. That's not gonna be good. No, that was an out. I, I'm the red and blue team. They're the red and white team, just for clarification. Not excused? Oh, okay. That's a home run, I think. Maybe. No, it's not. Still got to first, though. Yeah, that was a foul. <laughs> that was very much foul. I'm almost impressed, actually, with that foul. <laughs> Welp, 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 welp. I'm back to pitching there, back to batting. Ooh, this is gonna go good for me. It did go good for me. And this one? Okay. This guy wants to get s three strikes. Okay. I can oblige. Or not. Yeah, that was definitely safe. Nice. That worked. Ah, uh, that might have been a ball had I not swung. Same with that one. Well, at least we hit that one. How? No. That was cheating. Ye that guy should not have caught that ball. That was cheating. I am actually correctly identified two balls so far here. Well, the game disagrees. The game can be wrong. We've seen the game be wrong before.
one time just like glitched out on a player like Sir Rang what was it from like second base just like you know horizontally across <laughs> it was really weird I think it was something something like that anyway I don't remember the exact oh they got a home run script is not wrong I mean like it can be following the code but that doesn't mean the code is doing what it's intended to do. <laughs> it's more of a technology from the 80s. Yeah. Catch it, catch it, catch it. Did not catch it in time. Or, it did not catch it before it landed. He just stole second. Yeah, I'm like that. I was, I was wanting to get that guy out just because of stealing second. You know, technically it was also the better move anyway because you know he was the one closer to he's the one closer to getting a point. But yeah, that's all from stealing. Well, basically what you have to do is you have to you know throw the ball to you know whichever. Baseman, but the guy, thing is, the guy only started running as I was throwing my pitch, so there was nothing I could do. Okay. This thing with this game, there's very limited you know, things you can do. Which is why so much stuff just in this game comes down to RNG. Okay, so they got two points that inning. It's starting to catch up to me. Safe! How to stop. There are no guns in baseball. That's going to be, no, not good. Yeah, that was an out. That's probably going to be an out as well. Okay. Oh, the guy got, got on second was safe. I thought I was good, and then they got the guy in first out somehow. Legal? Absolutely not. Are you going to save the game? Absolutely. What? I'm confused.
using a... Well, like I said, there are no guns in baseball. And not just NES baseball, like... Like, if, if you try going to a baseball game, even just, like, with friends, and you have a gun with you, it will literally disappear as you enter the baseball field. Baseball diamond. <laughs> I think field works, too. But, yeah. It, 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 it's, it's a weird quirk of physics that nobody quite understands, but it, it, it's how things work. Yes. <laughs> you're aware you're just joking. <laughs> oh, so you're a physicist as well. Good to know. Mm, no. Yeah, that was foul. Oof. <laughs> this is not going. Okay. No. No. Wow, that was a fast one. <laughs> yeah, we got those four points in the first round and then just nothing. Or the first inning and then just nothing. bird, I mean ball. Damn it, they're gonna get a point here because my guy just can't get they're gonna get two points here because my guy can't get to the ball. No, well. Okay, just got the one point. But still one point more than I'd like for them to get, because now they're tied now we're tied. All tied up and wait. Okay. Come on. One more strike. One more strike. Catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it. Now they're winning. Put a power glove and have motion controls that just do not work. Well, I do not have a power glove. So unless you want to send me one. Also, does the power glove even do motion controls? I thought it just had buttons. It was just a glove with buttons on it. <laughs> Never actually used a power glove myself, but that's what it was. What I thought it was. What if you could find one? Oh, yeah. Safe. Okay, okay. Ah, that was foul. That's another strike. Oof, that's another foul. At least I didn't catch it, because then it would have been us out. Oh, is that... Home run? Nice. In multiple game stores, they do not have power gloves here. Oh, yeah. Nearly all my points this game have been from home runs. I think I got one point that wasn't from a home run. Only one of my points was 
Yeah, five of my points were from home runs. Because there were two times where I had, like... Yeah, I've gotten three home runs. And two of the times, I already had somebody on base, so... Yeah... They did. I don't. You don't have an NES. Oh yeah, I have an NES. Welcome back. Welcome back. Ah, that would have been another ball. Was I think all of them would have been balls had I not swung at any of them? Ooh, that's decent. Let's see if they got to first. And I get another home run. Or not. Mmm, this is gonna be an out, yeah. Okay, well, one of our guys is safe, at least. That's something. Okay, got guys on first and second. So now home run. Just because they always steal the bases, they think I'm going to be always stealing the bases. Okay, not a home run, but we should be able to safely... Ooh, can get a point here. And get everyone a bit further along. Don't push any further, though. Awesome. Awesome possum. Do we at least get a point? No. You even get a point for a guy crossing home there. That's unfortunate. Okay. At least we're, we're back into, wi into winning. We're back to winning. After that. I was not sure I was getting that guy out on second, but we just managed. This guy on the other hand, that was not at all surprising. What are you all running for? <laughs> catch it, catch it, catch it. No, just foul then. That's foul as well. This guy just likes hitting his fouls. Oh, nice. Okay. That's a home run. I've had quite a few home runs this game. That's that's nice. Because I think if I eventually want to get myself a game 99 to 0, I need to, you know, be very consistent with home runs. <laughs> that's going to be the key thing. The other key thing is making sure they don't get any points, but... Essentially two games. One game of my getting my... S oh, nice, another home run. Getting myself to 99 points. One game of keeping them from getting any points.
Oh, I'm surprised I wasn't foul. Oh, this was maybe a mistake. No, I actually got to third safely there. I, I'm surprised. I was... After I did it, I was sure that I made a mistake. But nope. Paid off. Okay. One more out. And then... Okay, yeah. And I can't get any more points. Okay, we got up to 10, right? Yes. Oh, that I shouldn't have swung at. Oof, that's an out. Okay, so... I got 10, so I just need to keep... So if I want to win this game, I just need to keep them from getting 5 or more points. And if they keep hitting like that, that should be relatively simple. <laughs> okay, one out. I just need two more outs on them. <laughs> just need one more out. Strike one. Foul, which means strike two. Can I get a strike three? Add to my collection? No. But I can still get you out. <laughs> hey, I win. Not my perfect game, but hey, still a win is a win. Which, oh, uh, what's in the mail? Letter from Lily. Yep, who moved to Protoris. Let's go save that in the post office. Switch over to um, Slicer. Briefly switch over to Slicer. I feel good though with that game of baseball, even though like we didn't win, or we did win, we, we didn't get anywhere, we didn't get like, um, I should say, a new like highest score or anything, but we got like, we're getting fairly consistent on a, uh, on a uh, home runs, like as far as when we were, we were, were we, I shouldn't say we were getting, we got a lot of home runs, I should say, which is good, because we just need to be getting all home runs. All the time. Okay. Freckles. So, let's see, where's my villager list? 
So now we have a letter from Freckles proving that Freckles has lived here. Okay, my keyboard was just being weird there for a second. I think it temporarily died or something, or disconnected. Okay. Um... Wait. What did I just do? Okay, now we want this one here. This one... Yeah, this is what we want. Keep them alphabetized within here. So that is 164. This is just how I'm keeping track of who's all, how many characters we have to live here. Because um, we have, we've filled up the storage in the uh, post office for letters. So we've had one, which is 160, and then now four letters in here. So 164 divided by 218 equals still 75%. Yeah, we've had 75% of all the villagers in the game live in this town at one point or another. And then we also, actually, yeah, who's our new villager? Um, Olive. So we need to go meet Olive. The other, ooh, and also let's grab our... Let's grab a slicer's uh, glowing spot here while we're at it. All of the other reindeer. this stuff out of Rick's gyroid for Slicer's house, or the basement. We don't need to go into Rick's house, we just need to talk to his gyroid. Come on, come on Slicer, work with me here. and such we're just putting down here. So firstly, the aerobics radio. Which plays the aerobics music when you turn it on. Tissue. Oh, I should actually be erasing this from the list of what we need. So we got the aerobics radio. The tissue. And a lovely phone. Thank you for calling Dial a Psychic. You're going to run late on an appointment. Even if you set your alarm, you'll forget your watch at home. Okay, and the piggy bank. And do you know what the piggy bank does? 
Do any of y'all know what the piggy bank does? Okay, so I guess tomorrow we'll bring over the angler trophy. And yeah, the rest of that stuff is stuff we still need to actually get. So look at, look at my money right now. 42,825. 42,824. 42,823. Every time you press A, you deposit a coin, you deposit a bell. So you gotta be careful with that. It can be very easy to accidentally use up your, uh... Use up some money you don't want to. Okay. Otherwise, I think we're good for today. Have a nice, uh, almost three hour stream. And, uh, we're gonna go find somebody to raid. If we discount the time I spent on break, it was probably about a two and a half hours of stream. So that's which is not too shabby. First an Animal Crossing stream. Let's see who we want to raid. Okay, um... We could raid somebody playing Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Or someone playing Luigi's Mansion 3. Or someone playing Outer Wilds. Or someone playing Ooblets. it's probably gonna be one of those people. Let me just keep scrolling a bit more through my following list. A lot of people I'm following are alive at the moment. Yes, yeah, so let me know in chat if you have a preference for any of those games I just mentioned. Otherwise, I'll decide myself we're gonna go and raid, and yeah. And I should be back tomorrow, 3 p.m. Central Daylight Time, with more Animal Crossing, followed by, uh, what's tomorrow, Wednesday, so Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Thursday again, 3 p.m. Central Daylight Time, Animal Crossing followed by Super Smash, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Friday, 3, with Animal Crossing followed by Adventures of Lolo 2. Saturday will be just Animal Crossing at hopefully 8 p.m. We'll see. I'm working late, way later than I'd like, and then I have to do grocery shopping after, so it's a bit tricky to say for sure, but we'll try for 8. Uh, Sunday will be Animal Crossing at 9 a.m. Morning stream there. So that's Sunday. The next Monday, Animal Crossing again at 3, followed by Blaster Master. And Tuesday, just Animal Crossing at 3. And that's the schedule for the next week. And since nobody seems to have a preference as to who we shall go and raid... I think we are going to raid... Let's go raid Melody Serafina playing Ooblets. Uh, she is one of my plant army teammates. We've raided her before. I have no idea what Ooblets is, so I'm kind of curious. I've heard the name before. Yeah. Absolutely wonderful streamer, so we're going to head over there. If y'all want to join me on the raid, that'd be awesome. You can copy and paste the raid message. Join on the raid. And yeah, thanks everyone for coming out today. Uh, those who chatted, those who just lurked, uh, those who hosted, those who followed. You're all wonderful people. Thank you for hanging out. It's been a blast, and I will see. Oh, and those who su subscribed as well today. Yes. Yeah, I will see you all later. <laughs> Let me just make sure I've copied the raid message. And bye.